Hi guys, Harley from Vitmill. Um, I was looking on Reddit last night and a lot of things, places, uh, and I saw the volcano. And there were loads of people going, oh my god, that's crazy. Um, there were a lot of comments saying, oh, I tried that, I can't do it, or um, even down to silly things like, oh, at least you won't be able to vape that. Well, I disagree, uh, and I'm about to show you how. Stay tuned. Hi guys, thanks for watching, um, a few tips, 
uh, things that you need to make do, you need to make sure that the coils are completely surrounded, um, apart from the bottom and the top. Obviously if the coils aren't surrounded, it's going to burn hot, it's going to burn dry, that's not good, you don't want to be doing that. Uh, additionally to that, um, I like to wet it first, have a fire on it, uh, then take the top back off, make sure everything's still saturated. Um, why did this time compared to last time wrong? And I put my coils a bit further out, so you just have to have that last video I've literally just pressed the coils in a bit, wet them again, made sure they're completely covered. I use this to constantly make sure the airflow at the bottom, um, because without that airflow, you will not be able to vape it, it'll just look like a cool volcano. Um, forever make sure that that airflow is okay. Uh, other than that, you need to just enjoy. Uh, keep safe. Make if you don't know what you're doing, make sure you use a regulated mod because uh, I don't want to be down for anybody getting blown up. Uh, make sure the coils aren't touching, and make sure you keep it wet. It burns so dry. It burns out so quick. Uh, don't forget to follow us on Facebook and Instagram, Vape Mill UK. Subscribe and like the video, please. Uh, this is my second video. Got a new mic to uh, try and adjust the sound a bit. Uh, and feel free to send me pictures of your builds. If you've got any tips or advice or you know how I could make that build better, then uh, let me know. Cheers, guys.